Hi folks, Drew Harkle Road here with the Trailer Source RV Center in Wheat Ridge, Colorado to talk about the Forest River Surveyor 295 QBLE. This is a great family coach with all kinds of features and upgrades to it to help keep you and your family comfortable out for long stays, short stays, traveling around the country. Well, you've got options with this coach. We're going to start up here in the front. You'll notice the power jack right here for hitching and unhitching and your dual 20 pound propane, uh, propane tank set up. We also have some LED lights back here just to help you know with that hitching and unhitching process in the dark. If you move along to the side, you'll notice we have a very large pass-through storage container here. Just, you know, great spot to put tables, chairs, any little thing that you might have that you need to store in here. It's going to fit. you got tons of room. I like pointing out on the surveyors that we do have the fiberglass exterior with the aluminum frame. It's built for durability. It also helps keep you warmer longer because we've got some better insulation in these sidewalls. Speaking of sidewall insulation, the sidewalls of these slides are framed in. So you can kind of pound on them and notice they're sturdy. It's there because what they've done is they've added an extra bit of insulation as well as just, you know, built the slide actually, I mean, everything here is just framed in and ready to go. So we'll take a look around here to the other side of the coach where we've got some great features as well. So exterior wise on this, we've got a ton of stuff and I like to just kind of point out a few things. So little Johnny's out over at the campfire throwing stuff in that he's not supposed to. Kelly's sitting over at the table and she's texting, sitting there just going on about God knows what. You're kind of wondering what to do. Well, with your huge power awning right here, you've got shade. So we've eliminated just sitting out in the sun, you know, wondering, oh gosh, where do I do next? But for you cookers out there, this is the feature for you. So we have an outdoor kitchen on this unit. Two burner stove, little mini fridge, and a sink here. All right. Best thing about all of this is you're outside cooking. You're not inside the coach when, you know, family time's happening outside. You can tell Johnny to quit throwing stuff in the fire from right here instead of having to jump out the window or run through the door. On the underside, we do have a little qu uh, propane quick connect as well. That is there for you to hook your grill up to this as an attachment out here to where all of your cooking can ideally be done out here. You got a great kitchen inside, but you know, you want to be outside while you're camping. Since we're talking about the inside, let's go in and take a look. All right, so now that we've gotten inside, I just kind of want you guys to take around and look at all this family space we have in here. We've got a couch, we have a large U-shaped dinette, bunk room in the back, which we'll get to. I mean, you can very comfortably sleep. I mean, four kids just in the back room alone. Two up here, two possibly on the, the couch here because it does futon down. I mean, we're talking very easily 10 people comfortably sleeping in here. If we start up here in the bedroom, one of the first things you'll notice, queen size bed in the surveyor here. It's the full 60 by 80 mattress. So it's going to be nice and comfortable for two people. Not stuck in that short trailer queen where everybody's kind of, you know, scrunched up there. I mean, we've got full length to stretch your legs out here. Now, LED lights are all throughout the coach. Most of them are operated by switches, but individually can be turned on and off at the push of the button in the middle of the light. Storage is not a shortage anywhere in the unit. We have wardrobe compartments on both sides, cubby holes back in the back by the bed, and little drawers everywhere, as well as a very large under the bed storage compartment as well. If we move back to our family space, this couch will act just like a futon, but pretty comfortable place just to you know, kick back and relax. We'll have the kids sitting over here at the dinette eating food, and this is very large, like I said, to accommodate for just about the whole family. If we look over at the kitchen section, we've got a double sink here, microwave, a three burner stove set up, as well as an oven. Name something you can't cook in this thing. Separate fridge freezer here for all those food storage needs. Plenty of shelves and places to put things. You know, throw your popsicles and your ice cream right up there. And if we move back this way, you'll notice this nice huge compartment here for food storage, for extra clothes for the kids. Really, whatever you need to put something 
I mean, you've got, you've got a compartment for it. Bathroom surveyor is great. It can accommodate for just about everybody. And the reason I say that is we've got a tub here instead of just, you know, your regular standing shower. So if you've got little ones that are out that, you know, too small to just be able to handle a shower, you can rinse them off right here and they're not going to have any problems coming along on the trip. And again, just good storage in here as well and a nice skylight to accommodate for you extra tall folks. This is what is probably the biggest point of the unit. If we look here, we've got four bunk beds back in the back. Weight limits on the top are 150 pounds. Bottom, you don't have to worry so much about that. But you can sleep four kids individually back here. Johnny and Kelly don't like sleeping in the same bed. Can't do it. They're going to beat each other up all night. Well, they've got their own space with some floor between them. Extra entertainment set up here so you can hook a TV back up here for the kids. And plenty of places to put all of their nice little things. Toys, clothes. Johnny can bring his Nerf gun and wait till everyone falls asleep. You got a place for it. Well, folks, I hope you enjoyed taking a tour of the Forest River Surveyor 295 QBLE with me. My name is Drew Harkelrode. Come see me at the Trailer Source RV Center in Wheat Ridge, Colorado. Let us help you rediscover your weekend today.